Hey, this is Chris Schwark, I'm the managing editor at Star Local Media Newspapers, and here's what you can expect to see in Sunday's issue of the Flower Mound Leader. Uh, we'll have an update on the Mid Midwestern State University campus that's going in at Parker Square in Flower Mound. Uh, the construction has hit a bit of a delay, uh, so the building itself will not be open in time for the fall semester. Uh, so we'll have a story that takes a look at what that college is doing so that they can still have classes for students. Um, also, there's a proposed development in the southern part of Flower Mound that's, uh, temp for now, proposing to bring in two hotels, uh, 600 apartments, and a mix of retail and restaurants. So we'll take a look at that. Uh, and finally, it's uh, budget time for the town of Flower Mound, so we'll uh, have a story that examines what all's in the proposed budget for the 2017-18 fiscal year. So be sure to check out this, this week's issue of the Flower Mound Leader and go to flowermoundleader.com for more information. Join us as we kick off the 2017 football season with a preview of our local high school football team. Star Local Media's 2017 Gridiron Preview will be full of team photos and rosters, district previews, schedules, upcoming rivalries, and key players to watch. Check it out on newsstands beginning August 24th or follow along all season at gridirononline.com. How's it going? I'm Justin Thomas, sports writer here at Star Local Media, and just wanted to give you a little rundown of what you can expect to find in this weekend's uh, newspaper editions. As you may know, volleyball season is up and running, so we will be uh, recapping some non-district tournaments that went down this week, including the one in Justin Northwest, as well as doing some uh, team previews. Uh, another feature we have is a look at some of the more high-profile non-district football games that will be going down this year. So we'll have a look at some games for teams from Coppell and Louisville, Louisville ISD and some of the uh, tougher opponents they'll be facing in the non-district schedule this year. All those stories can be found on StarLocalMedia.com or in this weekend's publications. Thanks.